Hi friends, welcome to Lancer.com. Today we are going to see about iSCSI. iSCSI means Internet Small Computer System Interface. It's an IP based storage networking standard for linking data storage facilities like SAN. iSCSI is a block level protocol for sharing raw storage devices over TCP IP networks, sharing and accessing storage over iSCSI and can be used with exiting IP and Ethernet networks such as NICs switched routers etc. iSCSI server called as target shares storage from server. iSCSI clients called as initiator. This assess the storage which is shared from target server. Ok friends, now I am going to show you how to install iSCSI server target in CentOS 6.9. Now we are going to configure iSCSI server. For that, we have to install iSCSI target utils using this command. After installation, now we are going to start the iSCSI service. For that, you have to start the TGTD service. iSCSI service is named as TGTD. Using this command, we are going to start the iSCSI service. Now we are going to check for the status using this command. It shows TGTD is running. The installation is complete. Now we are going to configure loans. Loans in a logical unit number which is shared from iSCSI storage server. The collection of drives called Loons to form a large storage such as SAN storage area network. Now I am going to show you how to create a Loons using LVM. For that you have to list the disk in a machine. Now I am going to configure new partition in SDA. For that give the command ftsk-cu slash dev sta in here give n for creating a new in here select the partition type and then partition number and then first sector last sector give the size after creating a partition now we are going to choose the type of the partition for that give the command t and then choose partition number and then exa code 8e 8 e indicates linux lvm now the partition is created to list the partition give p here this is our newly created partition now save and exit from fdisk using tamalu after that give the command part pro after that reboot your machine after creating a partition now we are going to create a logical volume for that you have to create a pv creator of newly created partition after creating a physical volume now we are going to create a volume group using this command after creating a volume group now we are going to create a logical volume using lv create hyphen capital l and then size of a logical volume and then hyphen m lv name and then vg name now the logical volume is created now check for your logical volume using a command lvs which was 1.5 gp logical volume is created after creating a logical volume now we are going to create a loons for that you have to enter into a target corner file this is the command to enter into a target corner file in the file we have to add these entries in here aqn stands for iscsi qualified name and then date you can give anything you want and then dot com indicates the reverse form of host name in your machine and then backing storage indicates the path of your lvm after that save the file and exit from the file after configuring now reload the target demo using this command after configuring the loons now we are going to verify the available loons in your target machine using this command it shows loon 1 is created on 1.6 gb and it is online and then backtopping path is in our lvm created now the configuration of this ice cage is very complete in further videos we can show you how to configure line side of iSCSI. Thanks for watching the video. Please subscribe our YouTube channel Linux Help. For further tutorial visit www.linuxhelp.com. Any queries mail us to support at linuxhelp.com.